Hey folks, we are, what are we, Tuesday 25th of October 2022, uh, so we've got quite a lot of uh, big caps uh, earnings coming out here, um, essentially, we just switch over and have a look here, we've got uh, Coca-Cola, uh, all coming out pre-market now today, Coke, Disney, UPS, Raytheon, SAP, General Electrics, uh, General Motors, uh, Valero Energy, good oil company there, uh, UBS Group already announced uh, beat there on EPS and earnings. And uh, then it kind of starts to trail off Halliburton as well coming out. So quite a lot to come just before the uh, US session here. So let's get over and, and see what we've been doing um, on these charts uh, so far. Just let me find the right one. And here we go. So essentially, um, what we got here is, you know, a, a dollar that's trying to get back some of the losses that we had yesterday. And you're seeing this euro starting to get a bit more interesting here on the bids. Um, but looking across to the equity space, very, very tough day yesterday for equities traders, especially in the day time frame. But, you know, nonetheless, higher highs um, into the close here. Um, as we continue to uh, rally in this relief rally um, here. so you know, starting uh, back there Thursday uh, the 13th. So, you know, targets up 38.29 to the upside. Um, again, we didn't really feel the need to come down and test support. It's 39 or 36.98 half here uh, yesterday. You know, a um, couple of nice little shorts to be had off of VWAP here and then turned around back in and just really barcoded the rest of the session before coming in at about four o'clock and uh, bid up into the close. So, you know, slow beans, very dangerous action yesterday. Really hard to read what was going on once we shifted above here. And uh, really hard to kind of wait for good levels to trade. You know, we were looking at this test on the 37.59 quarter, um, which was quite interesting uh, yesterday at the time uh, to be watching the ladder, reading the tape. And if you are proficient at that, you, you should be able to get on that um, bid back up into the close from there. All right, that is uh, Spooze um, for the, well, the DAX. Uh, we'll say goodbye to the DAX. Hello, NASDAQ. And just let that load. Yeah, so, you know, uh, this is an area, 11.256 is on NASDAQ, up to 11.397s. Uh, pretty interesting. Uh, should we pull back to there? I think there will be buyers. Um, but for now, I think equities are a little high to buy. I would like to see like Spoo's come back to at least pivot here. Um, and it may not come back that deep actually today. Uh, okay, looking across at oil. Uh, oil very tricky as well. Uh, breaching new lows uh, yesterday, essentially on Friday's lows. And then finding buyers rally back to the 09 low. Uh, back again to revisit the lows. So very tough stuff on oil. It's got a lot on, on its mind. Two mil cut from the Saudis, 14 mil more from the SPR, from Biden. You know, you couldn't really blame oil for just really hovering around here. But we do need another catalyst to kind of drive us up. I think, you know, it's nothing better uh, to solve uh, low prices than lower prices um, on oil. So, you know, should we kind of test down into what I've been looking for is actually 79 levels, uh, 79, 72s down here. And um, once we test there, I think then we could maybe really look at a rocket ship to get back on up. Okay. But until then, it's really going to work this range really from the 8167s, probably up to the 82 or 8626s. And it's all contained within that invasion top up here, right? So, yeah, you can see that range just there on oil. Uh, all right, what else do we have? Uh, that's back up on oil. There we go. Um, yeah, I mean, the bonds, nice rally. Uh, cable as well, actually, you know, really enjoying, somewhat enjoying uh, the appointment of Rishi Sunak. You know, quite a quiet day being on average sold yesterday on cable. We're, we're currently up 0.4% on cable. I think it's target 1504 is bottom of the gap. Now, given that we're having this lethargic reaction down here, I think uh, you may be looking to be a seller again on the 1504s until we get a little bit more body out of what Sunak's uh, plans are. Um, 
So this kind of still the situation is still mullocks on in the squawk right in my ear right now talking about this again. Uh, gold, look, I think there's easier ways to um, get frustrated uh, in life. And, you know, one of them is trading gold right now. Um, it's an absolute dog. That's all I have to say about it. I do. I like the long 1646s. Yeah, I do. Um, it, a bit of support to be had in here. And then back up we go. So listen, that's it for me for a pre-US session. I'll see you in the Discord and have a good one. All right. A lot of earnings out today. Take it easy. All right. Bye-bye.